Book publishing in general is peopled by individuals who were not really in it to make as much money. We don't have the long history like we do in music or Hollywood of the middle layer executives who are making quite a lot of money and being chauffeured around in Rolls Royces. Actually, in, in book publishing, most of them were there because they love the printed word. And so that very culture allows them to look at digital more as friend than foe. Well, when we piece apart what it is they're optimistic about, they're actually optimistic about the general outcome for reading. They think more people are going to read, then they're going to read more than they used to. And if you're really someone who is a, in the book business because you're a book lover, then that's good news. It also helps though that they've watched what happens to other media industries when they do resist it. And so they can come into this more realistic in the first place and saying our goal is not to preserve the past because evidently the past isn't going to be preserved. So we just need to figure a new future and get there as quickly as possible. And that's a significant difference. I sat two years ago with the CEO of one of the big six publishers and uh, listened to him tell me, we know this is going to happen. We need to get in front of it and we need to do the best thing for our authors and our customers. That's not what the music industry was telling me in 1999. It's not what Hollywood was telling me in 2005. It's what newspapers and magazine publishers have managed over a decade and a half to finally learn. So I guess it's partly cultural, but it's also just the fact that we have enough evidence. There's enough history here. Media, when they get disrupted by digitization, get turned upside down. And when you try to preserve the past, you end up preserving yourself right out the door. Now, when we dive deeper and we say, okay, what about you, your role, your team, your company? That's where the optimism starts to wane significantly. And they said we had only 26% say they think their company is going to be better off in the future than they were in the past because of digital. And that's actually down from 51% the year before. So I think as people are getting into it, they're realizing this digital stuff isn't so easy that we might actually make some missteps. It will be challenging, but still their eye is set on the horizon where they're seeing a world in which more people read, more words are published, not necessarily printed, and they're inspired by that. So it says a lot about the culture of that industry that they can maintain such high levels of optimism even though they now know how hard it is to do.